Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So really quick, I wanted to pause this video and say I'm sorry I didn't have it up two weeks ago like I should have. My mic system broke and I got a new one and it is here. So enough with the chit chat, let's get back to the video. So as you can probably tell by the title, today I'm showing you some of my favorite DIY spot and beauty products you can make right at home. These are really awesome, so let's get started. I'm starting with this amazing and really hydrating DIY body sugar scrub. So just grab a medium sized bowl and some white sugar and add about half a cup of the white sugar right into the bowl and then along with that you're also going to want to add some brown sugar to the bowl about half a cup as well right in there and then after that just stir it up really well till it looks a little something like this so next grab some coconut oil and melt about half a cup in the microwave and then stir that in to your sugars until it's really well incorporated. And then next, I'm just gonna add some vitamin E oil for added moisture. This is totally optional. It's really great without it too. So there we have some really relaxing and really moisturizing body scrub. So this one's one of my favorites. So I hope you enjoy it and try it out. Okay guys, so next I'm making some detoxifying bath salt. So just grab a small container and then some Epsom salt. This is anti-inflammatory, which is really nice, especially to use in the bath and add about a fourth a cup of that. And next, just grab some table salt or sea salt and add two tablespoons of that. And then add one tablespoon of baking soda. And after that, this is totally optional, but I'm adding some lavender essential oil for scent and shake it up and you have the perfect DIY bath salt. All right, so next we're making some lip balm for dry lips. This is really fun and it's one of my favorites. So grab a small microwave safe bowl and some petroleum jelly or Vaseline and add about half a tablespoon of that to your bowl. And then after that, I'm just grabbing some um, lip balm or old lipstick you can use too as well for tint. And I'm putting that in that bowl and then I'm popping that in the microwave for about one minute and 30 seconds. And then I'm using a small container to store mine and you can use pretty much whatever. And then I'm taking that out. It's gonna be hot, so make sure you're careful. And then I'm just gonna stir that up to make sure there's no lumps and pour that right into my bowl so it's all filled up and then after that i'm going to screw in the cap and put that right in to the refrigerator for about five minutes and when i take it out it's going to be hardened and perfect and ready for use and this stuff is just really really cool i really like it and it gives a beautiful shine to your lips and so next we're making this really cool diy acne fighting anti-aging mask so grab a medium-sized bowl and grab some honey and then after that you're just going to want to add a tablespoon of the honey to your bowl and then just grab some turmeric i'm using these little capsules and i'm measuring out about one eighth of a teaspoon and adding that right into the honey and then i'm also adding one eighth of a teaspoon of some cinnamon and then i'm just going to mix my ingredients all together so the honey is really antibacterial and it's really, really great for your skin, and it helps acne. And the turmeric is an anti-inflammatory, which is really great, and the cinnamon is age-defying, so all these products are super awesome for your skin. So, when you are applying your mask, um, just wet your face with some warm water and apply it in circles going smoothly around your face in the affected areas, and then wash it off when you are all finished. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. Please comment some of your video requests down below. I would love to hear from you. And please give this video a thumbs up if you like DIYs and don't forget to subscribe. I hope you guys have a fabulous day and I'll see you next week. Bye guys.